did I come up with the idea for these? Well, what this does is it allows to drive the robot one direction, but roll freely perpendicular to that. So this allows the robot to drive, if I wanted to drive that direction, this one drives and rolls a little bit. This one will drive and roll a little bit. This one will just roll. So these wheels will allow it to rotate and roll any direction all at the same time. It's a good question. So you want to run it? Okay, let me run it. We'll see what it does. We'll make it drive over this way. I'll go ahead and put it down here. And a little bit confused about where it's going. That works surprisingly well. I'm trying to go up this way. And rotate at the same time. It gets, it gets confused with some stuff in the floor, but in the cat there. Yeah. Oh, I see. And it's got a bit of a bend. There's some play in it. Yeah, the wheels catch sometimes. So it's pretty cool design. Overall. Yeah. Oh, is this? How do we uh, stay in place? This way. That's a good question. Oh, okay. It's on the wheel. This has. Oh, you put an extra axle in. There's okay. a piece across here. Yeah. Which holds these two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. From wobbling. See how it builds up. Now that's a nice. That's a great design. Look at that. I would say it's brilliant. You don't even know what you're looking at, there, guy. It's a. That's an awesome design. It really is. It took a while to get it so it's so compact. So I can get enough wheels on there and keep a relatively small wheel. Yeah, and so that it still works as a holonomically. Yep. So it'll go either either direction. That's cool.